Broodmere, the dam of the great betters delight, all-time leading pacing stallion and money won in the sport, the red-hot roll with Joe, and the triple crown winner, no pan intended. So a field of six, two-year-old pacing fillets approaching the start. Here they come. And they're off. Ashley's Spitfire on the inside. Preakness on the outside. And these two are barreling out of there in their stride for stride as they move toward the turn. Ameraway has come away racing in third. Caroline Hanover on the inside is fourth. Restless Hanover is going to settle in behind her from fifth. And Chip Stack is the trailer. And Restless Hanover is still looking to drop in on the inside and now does find the five hole there along the pylons. And their straight alignment. Ashley's Spitfire eases away now to a two length lead under Dave Miller tight lines nearing the quarter. Preakness is second and they're rolling along 28 seconds for the first split. Ameraway is about three and a half lengths from the lead, gapped ever so slightly in third. Caroline Hanover is showing the whip in fourth. Restless Hanover a length and a half behind her. And Chip Stack is sixth and last in their straight alignment. Still strung out just a touch as they head toward the half. And Ashley's Spitfire and the Buckeye. Dave Miller lead the way a length to the good. Preakness tightens up in the pocket spot. Ameraway is right there third as the pace begins to slow. Caroline Hanover trying to sit in in fourth waiting for some cover to follow. So too Restless Hanover the half and 57 seconds, 29 seconds in the second quarter, and at the back is Chip Stack, who is the trailer, and they're still straight alignment as they move on to the far turn, and setting the pace is Ashley Spitfire with three eights to go. Preakness waits patiently in the pocket spot, Ameraway is third, Caroline Hanover trying to flush her to the outside, and Ameraway does edge out from that third spot, tipping off the helmet there as they near the three-quarter marker. Restless Hanover is further back in fifth, and Chip Stack is trailed from the start, Ashley Spitfire looking to take them all the way, rips through three quarters in one 26 and 3, and the field comes to the top of the stretch, and it's Ashley Spitfire. Preakness pops the pocket. She's coming on for Scotty Z up on the outside with an eighth of a mile to go. Then Ameraway, and then Caroline Hanover gaining ground in the middle of the racetrack is coming on for T-Track. Ashley Spitfire is digging in. Caroline Hanover on the outside. Preakness is in between horses. Ashley Spitfire is pacing away. Ashley Spitfire gate to wire. Caroline Hanover was up for second from Preakness and Ameraway in 153 and 4. Ashley.